This video was created by Vinyl Lake Puma of Vinyl Lake Puma Gaming. What's going on everybody? This is Vinyl Lake Puma and today I'm back with another Fallout 4 unique weapons guide video for you guys. Today we're going to be looking at how to get the Lorenzo's Artifact Gun. Now this is a gamma gun that deals both regular and radiation damage. And uh, this thing in particular has this kind of interesting ability to like knock people around, which is pretty cool. Now, of course, to get this thing, you're going to need to go through the whole Cabot House quest line, uh, which involves about three quests. And we're going to go ahead and show you how to start that quest line. And I'll try to keep the spoilers to a minimum. However, in the final quest, you're going to have to side with Jack Cabot in order to get this gun. Now, of course, what you're seeing here is I'm going to try use my persuasion skill uh, to go ahead and get into the Cabot house. Uh, you can also get the quest given to you by somebody that recommends it to you in Diamond City if you'd like to do that instead. Now, as you can see here, this is Jack Cabot, and that's the person that we're going to need to side with in order to essentially get this gun and of course the first quest in the quest line is special delivery now when you complete this entire quest line and you side with jack cabot he's going to tell you to come back in a week and what you saw there was that you'll get a notification in your miscellaneous quests to go back and see him and as you can see here I got the Lorenzo's Artifact Gun. Now, I figured what we'd go ahead and we'd do is we'd do a normal Deathclaw test, and then after that, we would go to Quincy Ruins, where all of those pesky gunner mercenaries are, and we would just kill them, too, and see how this thing performs. Now, as you can see here, I mean, even though this is probably not dealing that radiation damage that you would normally get uh, if you had... You were using this up against an enemy that was vulnerable to that, like uh, regular human type enemies. I mean, even still, this thing is actually pretty decent. I mean, it's keeping us far away from him, and he's not really getting near us because of that knockback, which is really nice. And a lot like the Justice Shotgun, uh, I recommend this thing for that reason. Really, the only problem with this gun is that the ammunition is kind of rare because Gamma... Uh, Radi gamma ammunition is kind of rare. But as you can see there, I mean, we basically flung that guy across the room. And we'll see another one here that we're basically going to do pretty much the same thing. So, I mean, those were lower level enemies. And there's another one up here that I'm going to go ahead and fight. Who's a little bit higher in level and he can take a couple more hits. But that's that. Anyway, guys, that's going to pretty much wrap up this video. If you like this video, please be sure to leave a like. And take care, and I'll see you all next time.